Hello everyone, uh, my name is Lorenzo Sabattini. I'm here with uh, my colleagues uh, Valeria Villani and Federica Ferraguti. We are all from the Department of Sciences and Methods for Engineering of the University of Modern Reggio Emilia. And this is the introduction to the course on uh, collaboration and cooperation in industrial robotics. This course is so organized in uh, three modules. So in the first module, we will uh, first uh, introduce uh, how to model a group of uh, multiple uh, uh, robotic systems. In particular, we will consider uh, mobile robots. Uh, in particular, we will uh, consider groups of AGVs, so fleets of AGVs uh, used for industrial logistics. And we will uh, introduce methodologies for modeling the traffic and coordinate their motion. In the second module that uh, is uh, related to the design of interfaces for robotic systems, we will uh, uh, provide a description of methodologies for uh, designing such uh, interfaces. For instance, uh, we have here an example of uh, an advanced and uh, intuitive interface for the control of uh, uh, mobile robots that can be controlled by means of the movement of the user's arm. In the last part of the course, we will move to uh, physical interaction among uh, robots and humans, and uh, we will uh, consider uh, the presence of an intermediate device that uh, provides the operator with uh, teleoperation capabilities, so the possibility of uh, physically interacting with a remote device for the control of the robot. And also we will uh, see how to physically interact with uh, the robot, moving the end effector of the robot itself, in order to program it in a very intuitive manner that anyone can perform without knowledge of uh, programming methodologies and the specific uh, uh, background on robotics and uh, computer science. We hope you will uh, enjoy this course and uh, if you have any question, don't hesitate to contact us. We are really looking forward to having your feedback and uh, enjoy. Excuse me, what time is it? Uh, it's 3.30. <laughs>